Hi, this is Nanda Hampiholi. I am a corporate trainer and an NLP practitioner. In this audio, I am giving you some details with regard to NLP. NLP is a unique model of how people learn, motivate themselves and change their behavior to achieve excellence in any endeavor. The term neurolinguistic programming was introduced by Alfred. This is also the same person who quoted, God may forgive you for your sins, but your nervous system won't. NLP is an integration of several disciplines, including neurology, psychology, linguistic, cybermetics, and systems theory. The components of the term neurolinguistic programming describe best what is this little known science encompasses? Neuro, because all of our experiences, both conscious and subconscious, are derived through and from our experiences. Both conscious and subconscious are part of our central nervous system. Linguistic, because our mental processes are also coded, organized, given meaning and transformed through language. Programming because people interact as a system in which experience and communication are composed of sequences of patterns or programs. Psychology is being used in NLP rather than programming because the word psychology comes from the word psych means spirit and logy is the study of systems. What can NLP do for us? NLP lets you model or copy human excellence in any form. With NLP, you can identify what makes someone exceptionally skilled and get that skill for yourself and teach it to others. NLP can help you become adept in whatever is important for you. Whether that means getting along with your family or co-workers or being more effective on the job or it may be anything. And why do you think NLP is useful? NLP is valuable wherever human communication skills can enhance results. That is in business, consultation, management, negotiation, education, counseling, therapy, relationships, parenting, nursing, public speaking, sports performance and many other areas. And what kind of results can you get with NLP? NLP can allow a therapist to change the impact of the past on a client, a teacher to change a poor speller into a good speller, a business person to gain rapport non-verbally, run meetings efficiently, an athlete to improve concentrations and more. Now the doubt is, is NLP a therapy? Friends, although NLP can be used as a method of therapy, the applications are much broader. Even when used as a therapy, it is basically a process of teaching people how to use their brains. How therapy is remedial, that is directed towards solving problems, from the past, NLP goes much further to study excellence and teach the skills that promote positive change that generates new possibilities and opportunities. In total, NLP can be learned and should be learned by everybody to bring an excellence in their life. It's just not the person who needs therapy needs NLP. NLP is for excellence in whatever you